Okay, what we have here, we are on the ACU-5 base where they have the LCACs. I don't know what an LCAC is, but this guy's going to tell us. Okay, right here we have a smoke pit, and normally that's where most of the business gets done. Okay, he's when being sarcastic and ridiculous. And you wheel and deal. Okay, he's still being sarcastic. I guess this guy is kind of And a, right here is a building where if you're on duty, you stay here all 24 hours. If you're like uh, a real strong man or something, you can come by and back here. Okay. Kind of like prison. You got your uh, weightlifting area outside. Here, here we have the uh, buildings where the shops are, the maintenance shops. You got the and electrical room, the, mechanical uh, room. I'm about to take you into the shore facility HT shop where the they do what I did in Annapolis. Well, they do it here on the LCACs, mainly aluminum. Okay. okay, we got. Now, if you just follow me, keep coming, watch your feet over there. Uh huh. And these big facilities back here is where, uh, if there's a major overhaul going on on one of the hovercrafts, then they pull it in there. It's kind of like a garage for a car. They have okay. lifts, they can lift it up, turn it 90 degrees, and lift it like that. Woo, wow, wow. Okay, now right on in here. Oh, excuse me, sir. I'd like to remind you, we only have nine okay, minutes well, left. Moving, keep moving, don't stop. Less than nine minutes, sir. Let's go. Now, where are we going now, sir? This is the machine shop, sir. Okay, this is the machine shop for the ACU-5. Hey, you doing? How you doing, How you doing sir? Not too bad. Thank you. And that okay. was the office. Oh, man, it's locked. What the? <sighs> okay. Hang on, don't worry. Sometimes, sometimes it's like that. Bring it right on over here. Okay, we're going to see a, a live action LCAC. I still don't know what an LCAC is, but we're going to find out. Ooh. Quick, quick, quick. Lights are out. Let's Somebody go. Just says, make it quick. Okay, lights are out. Turn it on. Get the shot, and let's get out. Okay, let me get it on night vision here. Let's see what we got. This is a mechanic shop where they teach. This is where the welders are. we this got about 30 welders over here. This is the welding room. Okay, now watch your steps, stay in between the white lines. Look, you see all the bar wall on them? There's about 30 bar This is a special, this is a special good, undercover. Let's take this exit right here and we're going to go out to see the other This is a special undercover welding that we are not even supposed to be in. This is all... Let's go. Highly, okay, strictly you personal. You can see one of the LCACs right here. It's real, uh, really a great view because you can see underneath it. Okay, what does LCAC stand for, sir? Landing craft air cushion. Landing craft. What does that kind of machine do? It's a hovercraft right here. Here you go. This is a Navy live. issue. This is as live as it gets. Okay, these I got my right camera here, zoomed out. as talking about so many dang horsepower, you can't believe it. They're jet turbine engines. <laughs> Okay, now check it out. This is the How many jet? This bag right here inflates with only 5 psi of uh, air, but it's actually getting pushed in there through these jet turbines at a million cubic feet per minute. One million cubic okay. feet per minute. See, you can see under here. This is solid wood, one eighth inch, the whole bottom. These are stiffeners, and they make sure that it doesn't bend and swerve and sway so on. So we're it. looking at the bottom of the ship here. Bottom, it's a boat. Anything less Listen than, to that. Like, Listen uh, how thick that steel is. Eight inch thick. It's a boat. See, this is the underneath of it. This is the bag right here. Let me here. turn that night light on. Get a One section of this bag weighs almost a ton. And there's four, like 14 sections on this. On this. Uh, we're actually standing underneath. We are actually standing underneath the LCAC. We are underneath okay. it right now. Check it out. I'm going to come out here. Because they're working underneath it. Fixing the Reconstructing the hull. I'm going to okay. zoom now, up. Let's go, let's go on board. This, this okay. is a humongous machine. I mean, this make thing sure is... Sure this USA right here. To make it simple for everybody, this is actually a Hoover craft. This is actually a humongous military uh, issue Hoover craft. This right here is the parking lot where they all park. Okay, once again, he's being sarcastic. Okay, what we have here, this is, here is a Hoover craft. 
Uh, excuse me, sir. Is there any way possibly we can go on that hoovercraft outside? It's better lighting. Yeah, sure. We can do okay, that. there's a whole bunch okay. of hoovercrafts out there. Go on uh, number 45. Or this one's right here, so we'll go on it. It's Why don't we go out there in the sun where the light is better, we'll sir? Okay, we're going to go on LCAC 59. Has that been across the world, or is that just like an in-base thing right here for practice? I don't know exactly where they've been, but they just transferred two of them out to Japan, Sasebo, Japan. And? Uh, I don't know if they're good okay. or bad. And they, so check it out. Zoom in on number 33. They're replacing the, the uh, rubber bag on the bottom because there's probably something wrong with it. Right here. You could probably get a better picture of the inside of the hull. So that rubber bag, it fills up with air like... It poops up with air. And, air comes and it actually lifts this thing off the ground. How many inches? No, not an inch. So, but it hoovers across dry or wet dry, land. Dry, wet. If the roads were big enough, they could go on the, high, the California highway. For how long, though, I mean? Until it get, runs out of gas. Oh, my God. We are looking. I think they have two, like, 900... Sir, can... Tanks. How tall are you, sir? 5'8". He's five foot eight inches. Walking with plenty of this, clearance. This machine is humongous. It's like a miniature. Remember, nine minutes. It's, it's like a miniature ship. This is what we Watch got here. Step when you come off on here. Okay, we got to go up the steps to get onto it. It's humongous. I just can't. So, what do you do with these? I mean, does it a transport or yeah, yeah, yeah. to transport they, they, Marines? What they do is they drive straight up on the beach so that the Marines don't have to get wet. So. When they're on the ship, they Semper put all the Marines on here. They put Marines the come first and leave last. They drive straight up on the beach. They go all the way down off, it's called off cushion. And, they, and that ramp right there sets flush to the ground. And the Marines take their Humvees, tanks, and drive them straight off. So this feels like concrete that I'm standing on. Is that some kind of special? No, this is uh, 3 8 plate, 3 8 aluminum plate from that engine to this engine. I'm going to zoom in on this pole to, to show you how thick this Aluminum is on this. Aluminum. And it's painted with what we call That's uh, three ace thick. This is called non-skid painting. This is military issue non-skid paint. Look how thick just the paint is on this stuff. All right, now, it's, if you can check it out, um, these things have four jet turbines on them. Okay? Four jet turbines. Two for the... Uh, the okay, uh, is this an air intake jet turbine here or is yeah. that... That's exactly what it is. All right, they have two for the Let's fans. Let's go over here. The sun is... And they got two for the lift fans. These lift fans are what I was talking about. These are the cabins. And these things right here are the, what we call the valve thrusters. And they help, they help. Where is the valve thrusters, sir? These two, uh. Oh, these the, the intakes. No, those throw air out. Oh, those throw air out? Yeah. They help, they help uh, steer the boat. So where the does the crew stay? Is there a. There, you know, Credo's to stay on here. Oh, there's nobody on here. What are these for, sir? These are for, uh, like they go around here to block this. So you Something don't fall in. in there. Yeah. Because that's like the intake manifold. I'm going to get a close-up like look at this turbine engine. Do you know how many horsepower that might be, sir? Do not. There's so, so many obstacles, buttons, switches. This is, this is where the crew stays for uh, while they're driving. Only in America. Only in America. Yep, one, two, three, four. There's four engines. Yeah. And inside here, this is this is where all the uh, oil stations, main reduction gear, everything. Here's here's like this is what this is kind of like the transmission. If this were a car, this would be the transmission right here. It's the gearbox and everything like that. So how many gears are on that? Two speed, three speed. On and off. That's it. Engaged and not engaged. Okay, like here's the, here's like the lube oil filter, lube oil mixer. Is that hydraulic fluid? Is that oily waste? No. Uh, one of them is hydraulic oil, and then one of them is lube oil for the engine. And we're down to exactly forty-five I think this is the seconds. Exhaust. Let me make a clean sweep across this, ahead, sir, so the rest of the world can see exactly what America, what you're dealing with when you're dealing with the United States That's of America. The, uh, so I'm going to walk over here. As you can see, this is an on-off ramp on either side. I'm going to walk over here and get a zoom of all the LKQs that we have on LCAC. this base. LCAC, I'm sorry. LCAC's everywhere. These things are humongous. Okay, that's all I can tell you, folks. It's Navy, and what do you, what do you, what do you want to do? Thank you.